Assalamualaikum and hi my lovely student. So, in this video, we are going to discuss self-practice 2.1a. Okay, so this is question number one. Write three numbers to represent numbers in base 2 up to base 9. So, this is my answer. You can write any number, any, any three numbers, represent number in base 2 up to base 9. But please make sure that if you want to write base 8, so the number, the digit you write must be less than 8. Alright, so question number 2. Circle 3 number which do not represent number in base 6. So for sure this, this one cannot because consists of number 6. Here, number 7 and here got number 8 and number 9. Digit 8 and 9. 7 and 6 cannot be in the number in base 6. Okay. Based on the four number above, identify and list all the number with the following bases. So, for base 5, only 1. Base 7, 2 number. Base 8, 3 number. Base 9, 4 numbers. Okay. So, next question number 4. If you think that I'm too fast for you, you can pause this video okay, to check your answer. So, determine the place value of the underlined digit. So, we want, uh, we want to determine the place value for the underlined digit only. So, this is uh, how we do. So, first you write the place value and the number. So, the place value is... 2 to the power of 4. If you uh, don't want to write this, uh, to draw this table, it's okay. You can uh, you can uh, write straight away the answer because this is very uh, easy question, right? So this is 2 to the power of 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. So for sure, the answer is 2 to the power of 4. This one, I just show the, solution, uh, the, the table. But if you don't want to draw the table, it's okay. You can uh, straight away write the answer. So I will go. I will go through the answer. So this is the answer for B, C, D, E, F, B, and H. I. Okay, okay, IG. So this is very easy question. Question number five. Determine the value. Now we want to determine the value. Just now only this value. So the value you have to uh, multiply the digit with the place value. So this is the place value. This is the digit. So just you just multiply the underlined digit with the is value 1.4 is 4 okay so I will go through the answer so this is the answer for B C C A B E F G H I and J. Okay, this one also very easy to understand. Uh, just cut, just multiply the digit, the underlined digit with the this value. Okay, next question number six. Determine the values of the following numbers in base ten. Now we want to convert the given uh, number to this 10. So this is how we do it. Uh, this is uh, this uh, this is uh, we do it in table form. If you uh, don't like to write like this, you can use your own way. Okay. So if you don't want to write in a table also can write like this. I'll show you. Okay. 
to the question is two two three twenty three base six so you know that the place value of this number is since this is base six so this is six to the power of zero six to the power of one so you just write two times six to the power of one plus um three times six to the power of zero so this is your first step second step 6 times 2 is 12, plus 3 times 1 is 3. Answer 15. Alright, so you can write like this, or you can write your answer in the form of table. Both are accepted, but for this video, I will show you all are in table form. If you do like this, please don't worry. Just look at the answer. If your answer same as me, then you are correct. So I'll go uh, through all the all the uh, questions. So this is the answer for B. So the answer is two seven seven. C. D. E F G H I And G. Alright. So please don't worry if your working step same as me because I'm doing in table form. Just look at the final answer. If the final answer is same as me, then you are correct. So question number seven determine the value of P and Q. So this is the answer for A. E and C. E, B, and C. Question number 8. Calculate the sum of digit 8 and digit 3. So you just uh, find the digit value of digit 8 and digit 3 then calculate the sum. So this is the answer. Next question number 9, rearrange that I mentioned in my previous video. You have to convert all of this uh, in base 10 first. So this is the value of 110 base 2 in base 10. So do the same thing for the rest of the number. So look at this number. So, based on this number, you have to rearrange in ascending order. So, ascending order, we start with a 6, 7, 13, 14. So, your answer must be, start with 1, 1, 0, 2, 1, 1, 1, 2, and 1, 1, 0, 1, and 1, 1, 1, 0. So, this is the answer. So this is the answer for B. So have a look at the, this, all of this number. So based on this number, you rearrange the number in ascending order. 
this is the answer for B. C. So, have a look at all of this number and rearrange them. Okay, question number 10. Same question, but now you have to rearrange in the sending order. So, convert this number to this 10. Okay. So, the answer will be like this. Question B. So, this is all the number in base 10. So, rearrange them. See? So, all of this number, you rearrange them. Alright. So, this is the answer for number 10. Number 11, calculate the difference between values of digit 5 and this number and this number. Focus on digit 5. So, this is the digit value for digit 5 in first numbers. And this is for the second number. So, we just minus uh, these two numbers. So, this is the answer. Alright, so that's all for this exercise. I hope you understand. Thank you and see you in the next video.